Have you found anything about your family yet? No, nothing yet. Cassandra was probably lying. If she knew anything, she'd have told the whole school by now. Maybe. But she seemed to know something. Hey, did you see that? This book just moved. No, don't open that. What do we do now? We need to catch them all before the librarian catches us, or it'll be a week of detention. At least. Very suspicious. It's almost as if someone put a curse on it and left it for us to find. Who would do such a thing? Cassandra. I knew it was you. Relax, Daniel. I'm not here for a fight. Just a little fun. Plus, I thought you might want to read this. What is it? What you're looking for, obviously. The Quibbler? That's just a load of old rubbish. I agree. It's a silly old rag full of ridiculous lies that only a fool would take seriously. Which is why I'm sure you won't believe a word of what it says about Ivy. Ivy? What? Did you think this was about you? Sorry, Daniel Page, but you're not that interesting. Goodbye. sure it's nothing. Wait, stop! There! Can that be true? I... I don't believe it. I think we should show this article to the others. We can do it after dinner, once everyone else has gone back to their dorms. Should we show it to Ivy? No. Not until we know if it's real or not. It says this sister made the other sister disappear. Or maybe it's the other way round. It doesn't say which girl is which. It doesn't even give them names. Merlin's beard. I didn't even know Ivy had a sister. She doesn't. This is all rubbish. It's just a quibbler spreading lies. I don't know. That picture looks very convincing. If Ivy has a twin sister, why isn't she at Hogwarts? Because Ivy made her go away, obviously. Just like she tried to vanish Cassandra. Oh my gosh, that must be what Ivy did. She didn't try to make Cassandra vanish. She didn't mean to do any of it. And you believed her? I don't know. But look, her grandmother also says the story isn't true. Actually, Ivy's grand doesn't deny it. She only claims the neighbors are spreading rumors again. What about the first day of school? When Ivy got lost, what was she really up to? Who's dangerous? Ivy, what are you doing here? I thought you left. I did, but I came back for another pancake. What are you all looking at? 
Don't get mad, Ivy, because it's probably nothing. But... The Quibbler? Where did you get that? Cassandra. Cassandra? Why? What's in here that she wants you to see? Is it something about your family? Uh, actually, there's something about you in it, Ivy. What are you talking about? Wait, is that me? And a sister? But I don't have a sister. Are you sure? Of course. It's just me and Dad and Nana and... Wait. I did remember something, but it's blurry. Are you sure it was me in that magazine? It doesn't mention you by name, but it must be. You're wearing the same locket. Oh. I see. But how could I not remember having a sister who disappeared? But you know how to use Evanesco, right? That's a vanishing spell. Yes, but... You don't all believe this, do you? That I could do this? No, of course not. We just... We want to know the truth. You do believe it. <laughs> That didn't go well. What do we do now? Give her some time. If she really has a sister, she'll remember. Hi, Ivy. We're going to watch Robin and Kevin play Quidditch. If you want to join us, I think Lottie's going to try drawing a group portrait while we're there, too. Thanks, but I doubt anyone else wants to see me. They're all afraid of me. I don't blame them. I'd be afraid of the girl who vanished a sister she didn't know she had, too. Still don't remember anything, then? Nothing. I feel like there's more, something important. But I can't remember. How could I forget a sister? Did you send an owl to your parents? I did. But it was Nana who replied. That's my grandmother. She said I shouldn't believe everything I read in the Quibbler. But she didn't deny it. I think she might be hiding something. Something about me. Ivy, you keep touching your locket. Do you know what's inside it? No. But it feels special. Like I can almost remember something about it. That makes sense, because it looks like a memory. The kind that can be viewed in a pensive. Of course! Daniel, you're a genius! That must be why I'm wearing it. To remember. That might be a problem. As far as I know, there's only one pensive at Hogwarts, and it's in the headmistress's office. Oh no! I don't want to tell Professor McGonagall. If she thinks I made my sister disappear, she'll expel me for sure. Or worse! Then we'll just have to pay her off as a visit, when the professor isn't in. Did you get the password? I did, my friends. It's Ronsky Faint, as in Quidditch. The headmistress is quite a fan. Thank you. Anything for you, my dear. I also took the liberty of chatting up the portraits within. The former headmasters are a particularly sedentary lot, but they all left at once when I announced my intentions to stay. You should have the office to yourself for a little while. Good luck! Brilliant. Thanks, Gossamer. Excuse me. 
Have you seen a funny little fellow in a suit of armor? He was here a moment ago, but seems to have disappeared along with everyone else. Oh, um, Gossamer had to leave. How unfortunate. I do enjoy his company, but it appears I have three replacements, none of which is the head mistress. I do hope Minerva has not been sacked. No, sir. Professor McGonagall was busy, and we thought it best to not bother her. We'll be going now. But you just got here. Surely you didn't sneak into the headmistress's office just so you could scamper off. We came to use the pensive, sir. I have a memory I need to see. One I seem to have forgotten. Ah, I see. But in that case, you might want to check the cupboard against the far wall. Thank you, sir. You're most welcome, but a word of warning. A rather troublesome creature has taken up residence in that cupboard. Proceed with caution. It's unlawful. I'd say that more than troublesome. Cornish Pixels! Niffler! Are you you want Dirty Performer? just turn into you, Ivy? It seemed like it. But why? Ah, here's the pencil. What do I do? Open the locket and pour the memory into the pencil. I hope this provides some answers. It's going to be all right. I promise. But we're supposed to go to school together. Why are you leaving me? Stop it! Ah! No! Have enough! It's true. I have a twin sister. And I killed her. I don't think you killed her, Ivy. You just made her disappear, like the suit of armor. She might have come back. It's hard to tell because the memory isn't all there. But I used Evanesco. You saw it! How could I forget this? I don't even remember her name! Maybe it isn't real. I've seen memories in the Pensy before and they were much clearer. Yours might have been tampered with. Where did you get that locket? I don't... I don't remember. But I never take it off and now I know why. It's a reminder. Of who I really am. <laughs> You're not a bad person, Ivy. You don't mean that. I can see it in your eyes. 
You're frightened of me. It's not. I mean... It's okay. I'm afraid too. Then let us help you. There has to be an explanation. We'll figure out the truth together. Thank you, but I don't think I trust myself. I need to be alone. That will be safer for you too. Please don't follow me. I still don't believe Ivy is a bad person. She can't be. I agree. There must be more to the story. But what if the rest is worse than what we saw? What if she really did make her sister disappear? Then we'll do whatever we can to help Ivy get her back. Okay, but we don't know for sure that Ivy's sister even exists. There were only some way to prove it. Wait, in Ivy's memory, her sister was packing for school, right? Therefore she got a letter of acceptance. There must be a record of all the students accepted to Hogwarts. There is. All the names of those accepted to Hogwarts are written in the Book of Admittance. That's perfect. Where is it? I don't know. My mom told me about it, but just said it was locked in a tower so it can go about its business in private. Whatever that means. But there's so many towers at Hogwarts. We don't even know where to begin to look. We don't, but I know who might. Gossamer! <laughs>